How to circular breathe, part two. This is how you hold the note forever. Once again, this is a party trick, don't ever do it. Step one, watch my last video and do it with a straw and a cup of water. Practice until you get it right. Step two, pick a note on your instrument that isn't too high or too low. I choose this middle D on euphonium. Higher notes require a faster, smaller airstream, which is difficult to sustain with just the air from your cheeks. Lower notes, on the other hand, require a slow but very large column of air. You'll find at first that there's going to be a bump or a break in your sound. So first, experiment with keeping a consistent tone alternating between puffed and unpuffed cheeks. Then, when you add the breath in, focus on keeping your tone as smooth as possible. Won't be easy at first, but with enough practice, you'll smooth it out. You can also try and masking the bump by trilling between two notes. Just be persistent, consistent, and insistent, and you'll be circular breathing in no time. You're doing an amazing job. Keep up the good work. I'll see you next time.